Today's word of encouragement comes from Genesis 32, verse 29. It says, Jacob asked, saying, Tell me your name, I pray. And he said, Why is it that you ask about my name? And he blessed him there. You know, Jacob was quite a, quite a scoundrel. He, he, was, he divided to family, he, he lied, uh, but one night he was ambushed by a stranger who wrestled with him all night long. The stranger finally touched Jacob's hip, causing it to come out of joint. And that pain must have been incredible. Yet, Jacob wouldn't give up. Somehow, by then, he knew he was wrestling with God. Tell me your name, he cried. The stranger said, why is it that you ask about my name? And he blessed Jacob. Isn't that a strange story? Jacob's question implied that he knew he had to change and that only God, the God of heaven could really change him. He wouldn't let go until the change actually came. God literally wrestled him into submission and into faith and into obedience. From that time on, Jacob walked with a limp, but he walked by faith. The Lord is able to subdue the part of us that resists him. So seek out his name and don't let go of him and let him change you and bless you. We try to avoid in our culture, you know, the pain and, and, and suffering, but actually the pain and suffering can be a blessing if, if we take what it is trying to change in us. John Bloom said, quote, when God calls you to wrestle with him in prayer, it is an invitation to receive his blessing. Do not let him go until he blesses you. With that word of encouragement, God bless, and we'll talk to you later.